I found an inchworm. Oh, hi. What's up, Cat Human Collab? It's Maggie, your Wednesdays. Wait, before I start this video, go check out the video that I posted yesterday where I announced the new members of Casual Collab. This week on Casual Collab, we're doing types of week. Now, as a person that has gone to many shows and a few concerts in my life, I find there are a lot of different types of people at these concerts. Also, as you're watching this video, if you recognize yourself as one of these types of people, make sure to comment down below. First type of person at these concerts is the person that is all decked out in merch. I relate to this person on a spiritual level. When I went to the Lady Gaga concert, I was wearing Lady Gaga from the top of my head to the bottom of my feet. I was all decked out. Number two, the why am I here again? This is usually a friend that accompanies another friend who needed a friend to go with. Or if it's like a mom or somebody like that, a lot of times they'll just be looking bored, they'll be texting, going through Facebook. Or maybe they'll start getting into it, start dancing a little bit and find their new love for this artist that they didn't even know five minutes ago. Speaking of soccer moms, that leads me into my third one, which is moms that are actually there for the concert. These are the mothers that will go to like tween girls girl pop singers, but they actually enjoy them themselves. And there is no shame. The fourth one, the singer. And no, not the singer on stage. The singer in the audience who knows every single word to every single song and is gonna make sure you know it. Pretty sure I saved up all my birthday money to hear the beautiful voice of Lady Gaga, not you, screaming the lyrics in my ear louder than Miss Gaga. I'm just pretty sure about that though. Yeah, I'm one of those people, sorry. The next one, another one that I relate to on many levels is the Snapchatter. Not necessarily Snapchat, but just the videographer, the one that has to document everything. If you are paying $500 to see Lady Gaga this close, you better be seeing it with your eyes and not through a phone screen. I am here, I am in the moment, I am looking with my eyes, I am going to remember this, not just remember it through this phone. Oh guys, look, I got a new phone case. I Number seven is the Heightly Impaired. Again, relate to this on many levels. Get it? Cause like, height, levels. I'm gonna stop now. This is either somebody that is very, very short and can never see, or somebody that is wicked tall and literally nobody can see over them and everybody will be annoyed with this person, even if they're there just to have a good time. Guess I don't relate to that one as much. But it's a hard life being both of them because either you can't see or everybody's gonna hate you. So, the rich ones. These people are very annoying, yet I am very jealous of them. These are the people that upgrade their ticket to the max. You got the VIP, you got the backstage, you got the early entry, you got the you get to stay after, you get the sound check, you get the free food. The next one is the tween group. This doesn't even have to be tween girls, this is a personality type. Usually these creatures come in packs of about 10 and yes, they are only 10 years old. Their mom made them all peanut butter and jelly sandwiches and juice box to make sure they didn't get hungry or thirsty. Their mom brought them all Aeropostale sweatshirts to make sure they don't get chilly. And yes, you know that Karen has her GPS and her full gas tank, so those girls won't be late to the concert and they won't have any problem getting home and going to school the next day. If you are a tween fangirl, just go thank your moms right now because you have no idea how much they put up with. The next one is the yeller! The quiet moments in between songs. A quiet part in the song, or just when nobody's talking, is the moment when these people come out to pray. <laughs> that is their mating call. And the last one, the hardcore super fans. This is the perfect night you're with all your best friends seeing your favorite artist in concert. Super fans are prone to many things on this list. And yes, their Snapchat story will be 10,000 seconds long, but they have no problem with it. And yes, they will still be posting about this in three years. You're just gonna have to deal with it. For every Throwback Thursday picture, you know it's gonna be about this night. I think all of us deserve to be a hardcore fan at least once in our life. All right guys, that's pretty much it for this week's video. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and comment down below your favorite concert that you've gone to. Bye guys!